Welcome to Canine Thousand Sci-Fi Station. Hi, it's Kern 9000. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to my sci-fi station. I'm here once again to do another Doctor Who related video. This time I'm here to talk about the Diary of River Song series 2. Now I have to admit I haven't actually heard the first season or series of the Diary of River Song. I went straight to series 2 because that's the one that is currently included in the Humble Bundle, Children in Need, Doctor Who Bundle, which if you're watching this as it goes up, or very soon after, I seriously recommend you check out because it's like £15 and you get a whole bunch of awesome Doctor Who related audio plays. Now, all you really need to know to listen to this is about who River Song is. If you've watched enough episodes of the modern Doctor Who to know who River Song is, then you are all set. That will do. So, what are you going to get in this? Well, obviously you're going to get more of the time-travelling archaeologist and adventurer, River Song. And you're also going to get her encountering two of the Doctor's past incarnations. Basically... There are four stories in this set. The first one is called The Unknown and it's about a planetary anomaly, a scientific impossibility. I won't go too far, but basically River finds herself stuck in a situation with the Seventh Doctor. It's basically something's gone wrong and they've got to try and solve it. Obviously, the River knows who the Doctor is because she's met him in the future. But this Doctor doesn't know who River is. I enjoy Sylvester McCoy a lot and I think he actually had a really good sort of uh, back and forward with River Song. They mixed really well. This is followed up by a story called 529. A story in which River makes a terrible discovery. A discovery which leaves billions of lives hanging in the balance. It really is a race against time with River trying to solve a mystery before everybody dies. This is followed up by a story called World Enough and Time. And basically River goes to work as a temp at a company called Golden Futures. But she finds out that the president of Golden Futures is actually the sixth doctor. Colin Baker didn't get enough time on TV as the doctor. So I always like hearing him in Big Finish audios. And he really does get a chance to shine and bring more to the role. And again, because it's a previous Doctor, he doesn't know who River is, but she knows who he is. Now, the thing that makes this box set excellent as a set is that the fourth story, The Eye of the Storm, doesn't just have River in, it has River, the Sixth and the Seventh Doctor. And it really ties together all the previous stories. And it's strange because both of the Doctors have this dealing with her but don't really know who she is. She knows who they are. And you get to see her relationship with these two doctors and how she takes to them and to me it almost seems like she's got a soft spot for the sixth and finds the seventh kind of annoying but if you like river song and you like a relationship with the doctor and if like me you particularly like something which needs to happen more in doctor who which is where people meet each other out of sequence and times wibbly wobbly then it really is a great story 
this set works really well and it actually does make me want to listen to more of these I perhaps would go and rush and buy another River Song set apart from I actually have so much Doctor Who audio wise just waiting for me I've got uh, all kinds of stuff I've got unit stuff Stuff from the 10th Doctor, the 7th, the 6th. And hopefully by the time I catch up on it, more stuff I don't have will be on sale. But if you're listening to this and not much time has gone since I put it up, then seriously, get on there and get that Children in Need bundle. Not only will you get a nice slice of Doctor Who audio fun, you know, it's helping out a good cause. Anyway, that's me, Kerr9000, signing off, saying, take care of yourself and each other. Latest taters. Cheers. Hi, it's Kerr9000. I'd just like to say thank you for making it to the end of my video. I've got lots of stuff on my channel, my horror house doing horror reviews, my game room where I talk about video games, sci-fi station, my diet corner videos, all kinds of stuff. I can also be found on the Retro Gamer U forum and the J Arcade forum, which are both great places full of great people and some great video game conversations. At the end of this video there'll be a little icon to tick if you want to subscribe, a link to a video and a link to one of my playlists. I'd also like to recommend the wonderful talented Just Jessica 1988 on TikTok, who does a lot of diet videos and is my supportive partner. Thank you once again for watching my video and particularly if you follow me, thank you for all of your support. Have a great rest of your day. Laters, taters.